Don Quixote in Akihabara, 29 recommended items. Samurai Junjiro Channel Hi, I'm Samurai Junjiro, born and raised in Japan. This video is about Don Quixote in Akihabara. We'll introduce 29 classic Japanese snacks and popular meat dishes. We'll also show you plenty of great souvenirs to recommend, so please watch until the end. Now, let's get started. We have arrived at Akihabara Station. Akihabara Station is just two stops, four minutes by train from Tokyo Station. This time, we'll introduce these seven sections. Alright, let's head to our destination. The electric town nose exit of Akihabara Station is the closest exit. It's about a five minute walk from the station. This is Don Quixote Akihabara store we are introducing today. This Akihabara store opened in 2004. It's an eight-story building from basement to ground, and Don Quixote is on floors 1 to 5. We'll introduce them in order from the upper floors. First, let's introduce the 6th and 7th floors. These two floors are operated by a different company than Don Quixote and house an amusement arcade. There are unique games and claw machines that you can only find in Japan. You can also find popular character merchandise here, so when you visit Don Quixote, be sure to check out this floor as well. Now, let's go to the Don Quixote floors. Next up is the fifth floor. There's a maid cafe. It's a popular cafe with cute staff serving customers. There's also an English menu. On the fifth floor, in addition to the maid cafe, you can find cosplay items for popular characters and maid costumes. We have arrived on the fourth floor. On this floor, you can find Japanese souvenirs for international tourists and electric appliances. There are many items here that you won't find often in other stores. One of the particularly recommended items is the Senja Fuda. This is a wooden tag with international people's names converted into kanji characters and carved into it. There are plenty of them, so you can try to find one with your name. For your information, if you'd like to get the tax-free service, please make your payment at the dedicated cash register located on the fourth floor. We have arrived on the third floor. On this floor, there's stationery, toys, and more. You can also find character merchandise from Sanrio and Nintendo, as well as clothing like t-shirts. Next, let us introduce the second floor. The second floor is the main floor for food items. There's a wide variety of beverages and snacks available. You can also find daily necessities and cosmetics on this floor. On the first floor, there are three food shops. Also, there's a coin locker on the first floor, so if you have large luggage, it's better to use it. Now, let's introduce the 29 popular items we bought at Don Quixote. First, we'll have baked sweet potatoes. It's cut into bite-sized pieces and is individually wrapped, making it perfect as a souvenir. It has a natural sweetness from sweet potato. It's nice that it has a moist and smooth texture. By the way, at Don Quixote, the freshly baked sweet potatoes at the store are also popular. It's baked for a long time, so it becomes even sweeter and tastes like dessert. It's also great that it's an affordable price. Next, let us introduce the matcha latte from Starbucks. It's an exclusive item in Japan. You put the powder into a cup and pour hot water over it. Once you mix it, it's ready. It has a nice aroma of matcha. It has a subtle bitterness, but the sweetness of the milk makes it easy to drink. You can easily enjoy the taste of the cha. Next is the frozen pizza. 
you need to bake it in the toaster oven, but you can easily enjoy an authentic margarita pizza. It has a refreshing aroma of basil. It uses three types of cheese, so it's rich and creamy. The subtle tartness of the tomatoes has a nice accent. It's high quality, just like what you'd find at a restaurant. Next up, we'll introduce noodle and rice dishes. The first one is the rice version of the world famous cup noodles. Instead of noodles, it contains rice. After pouring hot water, you wait for 5 minutes. Once you mix it all together, it's ready. It has a richer soup than cup noodles. The texture of the shrimp and meat is nice. The rich soup has soaked into the rice and it's delicious. By the way, there's a set of mini-sized cup ramen at Don Quixote. It's a set of 5 popular cup noodles from Japan. It's reasonably priced, so it's also recommended as a souvenir. Don Quixote also sells cup ramen from Ichiran, the world-famous ramen shop. This instant ramen contains noodles, soup, and spices for 5 servings. Even when you return from Japan, you can still enjoy the taste of the restaurant. There's also Yaki Ramen, which is just released in June 2023. You cook the noodles together with ingredients like pork and bean sprouts. Add the powdered soup, and once the moisture is gone, transfer it to a plate. Finally, drizzle the spicy sauce, and it's ready. It has a nice aroma of pork bone soup. The thin noodles are coated with the soup, and it's delicious. It has a richer flavor compared to regular ramen. Yaki ramen has a special flavor that you can find in restaurants. From here on, we'll introduce four recommended souvenir items. First, let us introduce T-shirts. This is an exclusive item in Akihabara featuring Luffy, the popular One Piece character. The combination of the Akihabara character and Luffy is a uniquely Japanese design. In addition to this, there are also t-shirts with the kanji for Japan written on them. It's nice that the prices are affordable. Next one is erasers. It's a set of six erasers shaped like classic Japanese sweets. It includes a tray, so it's also a stylish decorative item. It's not only cute, but also erases text perfectly. Next, we'll introduce an eye mask that warms around your eyes using steam. It's a limited time collaboration with Pokemon. When you open the package, it naturally becomes warm. It becomes around 104 degrees Fahrenheit, 40 degrees Celsius warm, and it helps relieve eye fatigue. It has the aroma of lavender, so you can relax even more. You can also use it on airplanes or Shinkansen. Next, we'll introduce 12 snacks recommended by us, the Japanese. First up is this chocolate, DOS. The classic flavor is milk chocolate, but this one contains matcha-flavored chocolate inside. It uses subtle bitterness of Uji Matcha from Kyoto. It's a mild sweetness and an elegant taste. Next up is Alfort Mini Chocolate. It has chocolate on top of cookies. The chocolate has a rich and sweet milk flavor. The cookies have a pleasant aroma of wheat. It's a chocolate snack that also offers a delightful texture. By the way, Alfort Mini Chocolate also has matcha flavor. White chocolate and matcha go well together. It doesn't have much bitterness, so I think it's easy to eat for kids. This is a classic Japanese snack called Painomi. It's a popular one with milk chocolate inside a pie crust. We highly recommend this Painomi that is flavored like matcha tiramisu. It uses matcha in the pie crust, so it has a nice aroma. Inside, there's a chocolate blend of matcha and cream. It also has the flavor of mascarpone cheese, which makes it taste authentic. Once you try it, you'll get addicted. 
The next item is sweets in a Hello Kitty box. Inside, they are skewered dumplings. It's beautiful with three different colors of dumplings. It's sweet and has a chewy texture. We recommend it as a souvenir for kids. Next, we'll introduce unusual flavored potato chips. It's seasoned with cheese and honey. It has a rich flavor of cheese, but you'll also taste the sweetness of honey afterwards. It has a light texture, so you could eat as many as you want. At Don Quixote, there are also potato chips fried in olive oil. It's healthier compared to the potato chips we had earlier, and it has a subtle salty flavor. The crispy texture is addictive. The next one is a set of classic Japanese snacks called Umaibo. There are 14 different flavors in this set. There are various flavors like yakitori, teriyaki, sugar rusk, and more. By the way, the cheese flavor is especially popular. It has a crispy and light texture with a generous coating of cheese powder, making it delicious. My personal favorite is the takoyaki flavor. It has a rich flavor of sauce and a pleasant aroma of aonori seaweed. Please try them and find your favorite flavor. Next, we'll introduce Galbo Choco. The chocolate soaked cookies are coated with milk chocolate. The sweetness of milk and the aroma of cocoa spread in your mouth. The cookie inside has a sweet and crispy texture. It's easy to eat because the pieces are bite sized. Next, let us introduce a popular Japanese souvenir, Kit Kat. This is a milk tea flavor that isn't widely available in convenience stores and similar places. The rich taste of milk tea and white chocolate are a perfect match. It has a more elegant flavor compared to the classic chocolate one. Don Quixote also sells the especially popular matcha flavored Kit Kat. It's delicious, so if you visit Japan, you should buy it. From here, We'll introduce three shops on the first floor of Don Quixote. First up is this shop, Kebab Station Akihabara. There are kebab wraps and kebab rice available, but this time we have the classic kebab sandwich. It's a mix of chicken and beef. We chose the original sauce. The beef and chicken are juicy, and the sweet sauce goes well with them. The chewy dough and the texture of the cabbage are great. The size is large, so it's satisfying to eat. Next up, it's Smiley Crepes. There are about 50 different menu options, but we'll introduce this highly recommended crepe. It's drizzled with caramel sauce over vanilla ice cream and whipped cream. It's nice that it comes with Oreos and chocolate snacks. The ice cream with plenty of caramel sauce is absolutely delicious. It also includes cheesecake, so you can enjoy various flavors. The melted ice cream soaked into the cheesecake, giving it a creamy texture. The crepe batter has a nice chewy texture. The last one we'll introduce is this shop, Maruju Seinikuten. It's a popular place where they grill the meat skewered on a stick after you order. The most popular one is the affordable beef skewer. The scent of black pepper and meat stimulate your appetite. The meat is tender and juicy. This one is delicious, but the Kobe beef skewer is highly recommended. It's great to be able to enjoy beautiful marbled Kobe beef so easily. When you take a bite, it melts in your mouth. It's incredibly delicious, so if you visit Don Quixote in Akihabara, you should try it. If there's a restaurant you'd like me to introduce, let me know in the comments. Please like and subscribe to my channel too. Well, that's it for today. See you in the next video.